Thank you. In our top story this morning, a man is dead after a shooting involving an IMPD officer. It happened on the city's north side. So police say that, that man was threatening to shoot people from a porch. Gina Gleros is live this morning with the latest from IMPD. Good morning, Gina. Good morning to you, ladies. Yes, the shooting is now under review and the officers involved are on administrative leave. IMPD was called to a neighborhood yesterday afternoon uh, near 38th and College for a person pointing a gun and threatening to shoot people. Two calls were made to 911. Officers found the man on the porch of a house. IMPD tells us a witness at a nearby home reported seeing that man point a gun at officers. Investigators say two officers fired their guns. Police say they found a gun on the front porch. IMPD sending us a photo of that gun. No one else was hurt. This is the fourth deadly shooting involving IMPD officers this year. Oftentimes our officers are put in situations where they have a responsibility to defend themselves and the community. Each one of these incidents is, uh, has its own set of uh, facts and circumstances to it. That's why we have investigations, uh, criminal and, and administrative, to find out what exactly happened and what, uh, what could have been done differently. This case is under review. The IMPD critical response team and IMPD internal affairs will investigate. The officers who fired their guns are on administrative leave. That is, of course, standard procedure after a police shooting. We do know at least one officer had his body camera activated during the shooting. So far, police have not released the name of the suspect or the officers involved. Ladies will continue to bring you updates here on air and online at WTHR.com. Thank you, Gina.